Cybersecurity today is focused on external threats. You've got uh, cyber criminals like organized crime, state actors, and hacktivists. Uh, and uh, they're intent today on stealing your data. So we're very concerned about data theft, where these actors might try to uh, embarrass a company by leaking uh, personal data, uh, by uh, eroding their customer base, maybe cause them financial harm by uh, damaging their public reputation. Uh, I'm also concerned for the future about ransomware. We haven't seen a lot of enterprise ransomware yet, but think about what ransomware does. Uh, it enables a cyber criminal a chance to monetize worthless data, because as long as the data is worth something to you, then they can monetize it by extorting money out of you. So I think uh, I'm very concerned about the future of ransomware in the enterprise level. Well, when we help a customer start their cybersecurity journey, we always start with a vulnerability assessment. Because customers today, they don't know about the points of vulnerability in their system. How could they? These systems are very complicated. This is SAP software. There's a lot of moving parts, a lot of known vulnerabilities. And it's impossible for a typical basis team to stay on top of all of those vulnerabilities themselves. So we always start with a comprehensive assessment, which might be an automated scan, might be a manual assessment by a consultant. Uh, that enables us to create an action plan or a mediation plan to understand how to move to a hardened enterprise. Uh, the hard enterprise hardening might include uh, implementing single sign-on or uh, uh, improving uh, encryption settings. And so we can uh, help customers harden their enterprise against the threats that we were talking about before. I have to be optimistic. Uh, we're starting to see some energy around cybersecurity in the SAP space. My own feeling is that as an industry, we need to change our attitude towards cybersecurity. Um, from the very beginning, when we install software, it should be installed by default in a secure configuration. Um, I think we can adjust some attitudes and harden our systems from the beginning. Also, I believe very strongly that every person involved in an enterprise should consider themselves as a cybersecurity professional. Uh, in other words, not just some other cybersecurity guy who's going to be responsible for cyber. If you're an ABAP programmer, then you're responsible for cybersecurity to keep the bad guys from exploiting your code. If you're a basis administrator, you can't wait for someone else to give you instruction. You need to think about hardening systems as a basis guide. So I hope that everyone who is watching this video uh, will take this as instructions to themselves to consider themselves as part of the cybersecurity solution.